Okay, it seems to be live, okay. Good evening everybody. I'd like to call this order of the City Council meeting dated Wednesday, May 5th, 2021. This is a high priority meeting that is uh, Commissioner Williams and myself by Dr. Red City Hall and other commissioners, Commissioner Johnny Kaysen, Commissioner, Commissioner Julian Martin, and also our Mayor Pro Tell and Felicia Harris uh, are with us virtually uh, via Zoom. Alright, as we move right along, uh, first item on the agenda as we added uh, this agenda proclamation to be given to you uh, in regards to Mr. Pete Carroll. Um, and I will read this proclamation. Normally I stand down here and, and, and say it, but I think it's become better from here sitting here. I might want to carry a little, little more, I imagine. Um, before I do it, I would like to say what, what a great guy. What, it's an honor for me to be able to read this proclamation in honor of Mr. Carroll. I, I met him and I've seen some of the things he's done for our community. And what a selfish act to give back to your community. People go off all the time, but a lot of them, they don't come back to do, do things. But to do things in your community, to, to better your community, that is uh, commendable. That is honorable. That is something that will be, be felt forever, I'll say. Uh, I always talk about people when they pass on their, their feelings, their thoughts, their skills, their their emotions to others and make others better. I think that's what Mr. Carroll does. So this is a proclamation that says, from the Mayor City Council of Brunswick, Georgia, we do hereby issue this proclamation. So where is on April 28, 1941, here, uh, excuse me, local hero named A.D. Pete Carroll was born in Brunswick, Georgia. And whereas Pete came from humble beginnings, lose his father at the age of 12, Leading to tough times, forced Pete to learn what hard work is at a very early age. And whereas Pete was able to overcome these hardships by winning scholarships and enabling him to obtain his bachelor's degree in business administration and a master's degree in engineering, ultimately becoming the CEO of Georgia Pacific for 13 years. And whereas Pete, professional success allowed him to engage in philanthropy that was and is so impactful that he went on to receive an honorary doctorate degree for public service from the College of Coastal Georgia. And whereas Pete, philanthropic success included service on numerous boards that worked to improve the health, the safety, and the welfare of residents and visitors throughout Brunswick, Glen County, and the state of Georgia. And whereas one of Pete's most no notable acts was his ability to raise $1 million in one afternoon. After hearing the Ebenezer Baptist Church where Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. preached, fell short of funds required to complete necessary renovations. And whereas Pete's local accomplishments Include the creation of a teen center at the Boys and Girls Club, the creation of a teacher center at the College of Coastal Georgia, and his recent underwriting of half a million dollars to pay in hand of Glenn to help house the homeless. Now, therefore, I, Cornell L. Harvey, the mayor of the city of Brooklyn, along with my fellow commissioners, Commissioner Johnny Casey, Commissioner Vincent Williams, Commissioner Julie Mark, Mayor Pro Tem, Felicia Harris, do hereby proclaim this day, Wednesday, May 5th, 2021, as A.D. Pete Carroll Day, where the city recognizes the extraordinary contribution of a homegrown hero, where so many have benefited from his generosity and his kindness, and yet are unaware of his name or his story. This day shall be named Pete Carroll Day. Let's give a hand. Also, in honor of Pete Carroll Day, I would like for Dr. Johnson, the president of the College of Coastal Georgia, to come forward, please.
On behalf of the City of Brooklyn, we'd like to issue, we'd like to present to Mr. Pete Carroll the key to the City of Brooklyn. I always say this key doesn't open all our banks or anything like that. <laughs> but this key, all what it does though, is open up our hearts, our souls, and the gift to him. Let him know that he has that connection. But he's already a home, homegrown boy. He's already hometown. He's already that. But we just want to show the love that we have for him and for what he's done for our community. I know he's done some things for the college. He's done some things for other, but he is just a great guy. And I'm surprised that he don't have many keys to other cities. But I'm glad he has, we're giving him one to this city from his hometown, from Brunswick, Georgia. Something that he has helped put on the map. He has helped grow our city. I'm so proud of being able to do this. It says to the key to the city of Brunswick, presented to A.D. Pete Carroll, for outstanding service and dedication with passion and commitment to the city of Rome, May 5th, 2021. Please give it. Thank you all for being here. Thank you all for recognizing that this, young, this man has done so much for our community. And, and how we, the city, the city government, appreciate what he's done. And we, we want everyone to feel to do the same thing. But when you step out, Faith and do something to help your fellow man, help your community, that to me is the ultimate. So, our hats are off to Mr. Pete Carroll. Our hearts are here. We come with our hearts in our hands. We come just tell him thank you. So many people don't get that thank you. So many people, they live in life and knowing that. But we want to tell you thank you, Pete, for all you've done for us and all that you are doing. And, and your name will live on especially in this community, if not around the state, around the world, but your name will live on here. And will always be on record that May 5th, 2021, is Pete Carroll Day. Well, everybody know this is Pete Carroll Day. And I hope it's being enjoyed by everybody this day and forever, ever, ever more. Thank you, Mr. Carroll, for, for your contribution. Thank you for what you do, for, thank you for what you have done. Thank you for what you will continue to do. God bless you, and God bless America. Thank you.